My friends, welcome back. We are playing as the United Federation of Planets and playing the mod Star Trek New Horizons Into the Mirror Darkly. It's been a new day and yes, we are in two wars. We're fighting the Romulan Star Empire as well as the Shalak Corporate. Uh, for the Shalak, it is about to end. All of the stations are about to fall. That doesn't mean that I can sit back easily. We'll have to take out most of this so we can obtain uh, the achieve war goals it is still negative 57 so we got a bit of a road to go i hope that my allies are going to be focusing on all of this the um the Shuren league is not having a good time um that's uh, that's sad i've added a few more names like um semi sapainen i'm sorry for raping that name I'm, I'm, I'm i don't know how to pronounce it if you can help me do let me know uh raul um Sup supfa raul supfa and frank there's one more name on my list and that's uh, baseball boy now uh, he's been writing these cool ass stories and i feel i won't do it right unless i give him a fleet so perhaps we can give him to start off no actually no because then he would be a scientist <sighs> that's the thing i wish that uh, the flagship giorgio uh, what kind of ruler are you are you yeah and you are a scientist i would like to make him an admiral and just uh, have a fleet and he could go to uh, do pirate missions and wars and stuff like that he's proven himself in the federation something like that so um Hold on, mate. You will get into into the game. Uh, for now, I've made up my mind about this colonies over here. And I want to boost up my naval cap. Now, by doing so, uh, what I'm hoping to achieve is building a fortress world. And I've not done this in a long time. So, doing this might be fun. Getting some uh, fighter hangers in there, although they won't provide me with naval cap these do ground to space defense and they will deliver an average of 1260 points in hull damage per month which is actually quite nice still for boosting naval cap this would be the best like your local garrison so i'm going to build one and hopefully it will give us the option on making a fortified planet um, but we'll just see how that goes. Also, let's build this one up. And let's press on pause and let's take a look at this war. Let's close off all of these planets because damn, they're way too many for me to handle anyways. So, yeah. I don't think we'll have to fear for this station. Uh, it should be winning. So, let's not be bothered by it. You are fighting. You are about to go fighting this one last station. And hopefully it will get a peace deal rather shortly. Uh, in terms of minerals, we are doing fine. As you can see, shared stockpile is still... I wish there were a few more options that we could take. I don't know if these will do anything for us. Uh, but we'll have to see about that don't see a lot of changes not sure if i uh, need to keep this at 50 50 so let's bring this down to 20 at least we have some more room to breed um this station we are fighting currently let's go to the second speed why are you here who is lacking this uh, because the ships are probably fighting that's why it was built up I see an open slot here, so we're going to be adding a shipyard. Hmm. What shall we add? Orbital hospital is nice. Let's do that. A new science. Uh, we got a new war type 5 warp engine. That's cool. Regenerative shields. Oh, sweet. But this also, look at this. This uh, reactor increases the energy or the um, yeah the energy credits by five percent, which is very nice, very very nice. Okay, so the station fell. We are on hostile. What are we lacking here? 
doesn't see i don't see anything how about this one it's still fighting so that doesn't work let's go ahead and i don't need to worry about this shall we just take some of these uh, systems actually you go here and once you're done go there be aggressive, do whatever. You don't need to do anything in orbital bombardment. I don't think that's necessary. Uh, you can still upgrade. Let's upgrade you. Why not? We're having... Oh, wait a minute. Well, we could add you into this fleet. Doesn't really matter that much. But I was kind of hoping that we could see what you are doing. So that fleet fell. And look at these guys. They're just get going in here. Trying to take over everything that is like the undefendable. And they are completely neglecting the war with the Romulans. Uh, yeah, we're going to be sending this fleet in once it's upgraded. And push out the border inwards. Like we've already been doing that here with the Andorians. They have been doing nicely. But we do need to get some of these planets back under our control because i think they might have been taken were there planets in there no i don't think so we need to free up the sorens as well and uh, we'll use that one fleet it's fine it's going to be okay yeah these are our planets are i'll let them deal with planets uh, the ai i don't necessarily need to do so negative 50 so just a few more you no, you are completely full. So, these two, they can merge. Let's just say, uh, stop for a second, merge up and upgrade. Uh, the trust cap increases by 25. Now, that's going to be... I I'm thinking the Klingons eventually might be friendly towards me. Not sure. Look at that. It's a marine job. Plus one. Testing fields. Interesting. Admin cap. I don't care about the admin cap. We are way over our admin cap. And we're making a good amount of uh, of research. So don't feel like uh, doing anything with that. Let's see. Can we upgrade all of these? Um, well, I was going to be upgrading the star bases. And we're still going to. If we are able to. Because we do, we, we do need a lot more naval cap. Uh, who got in here? Montgomery Scott. Hello, Scotty. I love that guy. I truly love him. Okay, let's zoom out a bit so it is less obnoxious to deal with. Yeah, um, how far is this fleet now? If one of the captains dies, this will also be the point where um, Baseball Boy will get in there. I hope I am pronouncing his name correctly. I was looking at one of the... Yeah, Baseball Boy. I was looking at one of the... Uh, the Kenneth Logs. Which is so cool. Uh, I don't need them to be hostile. Let's see where they are. Uh, let's go to... Research that project. Uh, don't, don't get yourself killed, please. I would really hate that. Perhaps they get uh, teleported to the other side of the galaxy. That would be cool. Well, not really, but still. It would uh, complete like Voyager. Uh, this one... No, you can't win, lose. Actually, you're very close. Not sure I like that. We might have to send um, a ship over here. So, the Rubik Guardian. Let's pause it for a second. Uh, state your purpose. Why are you here? What do you intend to do to my children below? Do not interfere with them. Who are you? We are... You would not understand. We are basically this space, but also in it. Now, state your purpose. Your children? They call themselves Ido. My children below. Do not interfere with them. Um... Uh, yeah, let's, let's say we do not want to interfere. Oh, very well. <laughs> sure, if that's all that it takes, why not? Why not? Are you too fast for my um, for my station here? Could go there and then go there. That would be the better option, I guess. 83. 
Oh, okay, that station fell. Decided to join. Okay, I think that's good. We got the military training center done. Um, let's go terraforming basics. And we got a civilian upgrade. Would this be... Okay, it's for new vessels, but... Oh, cool. Look, this DS9. And the constitutional class. There we go. Oh, I've never seen that ship in this game. I was always like, yeah, okay, okay, I, I understand it now, and let's start something new. Uh, this time, I promised that I was not going to do so. Let's take a quick look here, since we might get new civilian classes, or... Oh, cool. Holy crap, that's cool. I was so not aware of this. Why, why take these? Don't we have, like, more science thingies? Let's wait. Let's, let's not save this. Astronomics lab. Surveying speed and anomaly discovery chance. That is so cool. Uh, operation station. I don't really care for that. I like the shield regen. Yeah, I like this. Man, that is so nice. Whoa. It looks so... squarey. But that's cool. <laughs> Why not? Why the hell not? Survivability of these ships are just increasing. Can we, can we change you? No. But with the constitutional class, I feel... That the flagship should change. This does, doesn't feel like a flagship no more. It doesn't. It's uh, it's getting weak. And I don't like it. Do we need to upgrade anything? I don't think so. Uh, we'll just see. Uh, let's kill these guys. He's almost done. He's going there. Um, the allies should be able to deal with the rest. There we go. Monthly energy credits plus five. And we are able to build another reactor. So I'm no longer going to be doing these. Or actually skipping these. Or we'll, be, we'll be taking them. Since we'll just see whether or not it does something horrible. But monthly influence plus one is just amazing. And I want it. If something bad happens, hey, it happens, okay? Now, let's go over here, and let's go into this fight. Since they, the station itself is more than enough to deal with the fleets, but it's time that we start pushing in, inwards with the Romulan territory. While building up these stations, still missing a few. I wish I could buy them. Uh, Chancellor Garen has become more... Um, experienced and he's becoming stubborn stubborn for a Klingon who would have guessed uh, we got intellectual which is nice so let's take a look here Flat at the Klingons card, uh, the border friction is very bad so I don't think we'll ever be on good terms they have declared us their rival what I just hope is Eventually they become weak and <laughs> yes, it will happen. I'm very sorry. Uh, they will become weak. Especially now that we're building up fleets left, right and Standing center. By. Like, look at the Cardassians. And they're still hostile. And it is because rivalry again. If they stop declaring rivals, it loses a hundred and we'll get... Well, semi-close at fulfilling one of these purposes. Perhaps integrating them. Not sure. Eventually, we will get that happening because we're just too much to handle. Too much to handle. That just sounds absolutely right. Uh, this construction ship. Let's upgrade. Let us upgrade all of our science ships who are currently just researching. Where are you going? Yeah, you're going over here. Can we uh, send you to upgrade somewhere? Yeah, you have to go all the way back. Yeah, that kind of sucks, but it's okay. I want to get these guys upgraded. Otherwise, I will just forget about it. There's just so much going on. I wish that you couldn't turn off 
a lot of this static around here. Like, all of this is just annoying. Can we turn off hostile images or something like that? If that could be changed, that would be so nice. So, let's take a look here. Negative 50, 45. It's fine. Research agreement. Let's get rid of all of this. Yeah, I know they changed by themselves. I do, I'm just always so annoyed that they are here. Uh, we're building up platinum because I did sell a bunch of it. Uh, to get more alloys. There is nothing wrong by getting more alloys, right? So, I decided on taking that. Okay, once you're here, go here. Uh, let's start dealing with these fleets. They're just annoying. Even though I don't think he can actually do a thing. Yeah, I don't, I don't have to worry about these, actually. What we are going to do is just taking all of this back. We're going to take all of this back. Releasing all of these. And my stations will just deal with the rest of it. So the Dell and Union have uh, shared interest in... Um, a research agreement which I will happily take. Uh, we are integrating you. I, I'm sure you are aware of this. We're still building up trust though. It's been a long time since I actually got the message. Now I would like to save up to I believe 200. 200 would be nice. Mm, yeah you're almost there. And they will start building up bases in systems that we haven't taken from them. You're not doing anything. Okay, so go here. We're going to give you a lot of chores. Then, can we just jump towards... This? Just go over here. Go here, have some fun. Man. Silla Shepherd has been... Oh, with us for such a long time. Look at that. He is like, he's almost 90. That's great. That's just amazing. I love that. So, these stations are about to fall. Negative 43. There we go. We are entering a fight. Yeah, that they didn't. They don't do well. It's, uh, it's not going to happen for them. Okay, are you upgraded? No. Upgrade. You. Upgrade. It's understood. And we should keep three scientists over here. Uh, once the construction ship is upgraded, we're going to be sending them here to get that. I wonder when the Bream will attack. They are also equivalent and unfriendly. Although they don't hit they don't hate me as much as say the Cardassians. Bajor is still here. Can we not offer you anything? You are unfriendly. Let's do a trade deal. Let's make them friendly to us. Let's give you... Like, Latinum. How much do we... We have so much. Uh, can we give you ice water and stuff like that? No. Um, Brazil Nitrate. I don't see that either. Lithium... No, of course not. Everything I would like to give away, they don't have it. Luxuries. No. That is so annoying. The Omega Molecule. Trained officers. No. Fine. How much Latinum are we actually gaining? 12. So we can give them 5. And give them 10 for 230. That should be a, a, a very nice boost. And now Coral, let us go with a um, association offer. Because they are Bajoran, right? DS9 should be in their territory. And I think that's going to be wonderful. Um, we only do the association offer. No, actually we do want to form like a commercial pack. Because we need to build up trust. Trade deal has been accepted. Coalition offer has been accepted. The Kardashians will probably hate it since they will now lose another of, uh, of their rivals. Engineering research plus 10. Let's uh, activate it. I think it's activated right now. It doesn't cost me anything. At least, I think. No activation cost without its other piece. Oh, active effect. Okay, so that's a bit of a thing. That's unfortunate. I'm hoping that we will gain more. 
Oh, look at that. Everything was just hiding in here. Well, that's fine. Uh, here we go. The monthly influence. Now, now stuff can actually start to happen. <laughs> I'm terrified. Honestly. I am. Let's see. I quite like this. The regenerative shields as well. So, next tick, it might ha something might happen. The Bream has finally declared me a rival. It's a bit of a fight going on. We don't care about it, of course. There is 4k over here. Who the hell are you? Oh, you're privateers. Uh, we don't care about you. So, go here. And then I want you to go here. We're freeing up our own territory. That's all that we're going to do. And we're going to be freeing up the Sorens. Although, I do feel that they are starting to push back. Association request. And we uh, start knowing a few more species. A war declaration of the House of Mork on the House of Kung. So, we don't care about that. Coalition invitation. Fine. Go away. Technology. The terraforming basics is now under control. Do we want to get more food? Uh, let's go with the Luxuries Hotel. Mm, sure, why not? I'll vote yes. Uh, we just want to... Um, Increase the coalition. Uh, although I don't see a lot changing. We can't build a coalition fleet. That is highly unfortunate. I was kind of hoping that we would have been able to. Let's upgrade you. You go ahead and go to the stars. Yeah, the station should fall. And then go there. Let's see, what's the war doing? 41. So, we do need to land troops on the planets. Although, I don't really feel the need to, because my allies will do so. You can see all of these um, armies going around. And uh, that's what I like my allies to do, playing this mod. I don't need to worry about the planets, my allies will worry about the planets. And this way I can just focus on... Um, Tearing them a new one, I guess. Uh, the station should be more than enough to handle. Apparently not. Let's see. Oh, yo, it's more than enough to handle that. Let's zoom out. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, baseball boy, hope you're not too upset about this. But I just want to uh, give you a fleet, mate. And that's going to take me a bit. As you can see over here. We are making more than enough energy credits. Potentially, we could just build another fleet. Seeing we have a lot of these alloys, I might consider to do so. How much could we add? Can we add a few more? Mm. Oh, the light cruiser is in there. Are these all weaker? Wow, it is, it is larger. The Kelvin class. Seriously. It's also more expensive. Let's add the Kelvin class. Just a few ships. And the Miranda class. So, uh, this is the, the one fleet. Uh, we're going to be reinforcing this fleet. Onwards to this one. No available shipyard to build from. What a joke. Anyways, guys. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.